Hey guys, it's the fish guy here, and this is my 20 gallon uh, salt water. Um, this video, I'm just gonna kind of follow my mandarin around a bit. It's probably gonna give him some food. See if he eats up. Oh, got to turn. There we go. It's just a little bright there. He does like to wander around the uh, top when I don't have the pumps going. Perhaps there's some copepods around there. Maybe a little less bright there. My uh, purple montipora there is growing quite well. I've already noticed some new growth on the uh, tips. Uh, the acropora is doing very well too, but I um, haven't noticed much new growth, mostly around the base onto the plug, but that's about it. i got to reposition myself here. He uh, sees his reflection in the glass. <laughs> I like the red in him, it looks really nice. Okay, let's see if he'll eat. Sorry about the shakiness. Let's gonna get him something to chow on. Here, let's try this. Okay, where'd he go? Bam. Frozen mysis. He can eat full size mysis too. It's actually kind of larger. Um Oh great, didn't even see that. Oh, maybe he did. There we go. Boom. My watermelon zoanthids. I'll show you my uh, MP10 on wave mode. I got a really good wave going too, which is nice. He definitely likes to uh, check out the heater and stuff for little copepods and whatnot and his reflection at times. <laughs> My green staghorn there. Pulps are fully extended now and uh, it's doing very well. See if he'll eat some more. Sorry if the camera is kind of off right now. Bear with me. Okay. You gonna see it? You gonna come over? Yep. Nope. Maybe. If he's full, he won't eat. He contemplates. Yeah, am I sure? Nope, I'm full. Maybe not. Not necessarily a picky fish. I fed him two mice about an hour ago, so... I was lucky when I got him, that's for sure.
Sorry if it's a little bright. I like to get my female in here. Just have to find one that eats frozen. <laughs> They'd be a perfect pair. Even though these fish don't actually pair up, but I wish they did. I've never seen the behavior of a male and female mandarin together, so I don't know how they'd be. If they'd fight or whatnot. I'd hope not. If anyone has insight on that, that'd be cool. Because I'm interested in uh, getting a female. Of course, that eats frozen like this guy. Yeah, you like the corner of the tank. I get that. Um, let's see. Little mushrooms, you know, the same old, doing good. I've noticed my favites is growing a little bit. Oh, it's hard to get him to focus. Uh, he's definitely eating well. Eats um, brine shrimp, mysis, kind of anything I put in the tank. This guy's got a little more brown than purple or pink or whatever, but I plan to uh, put some LEDs in my fixture, so. It'll brighten things up. The aquapore is doing great. And uh, orange polyp doing well. My orange Yuma is actually doing quite well too. Damn, I can't get a focus on it. Um. It has eaten a good chunk of mysis a couple of days ago, so it's a good sign for me. It makes me happy. I recently got a couple uh, Mexican turbos, and they're doing wonders for the algae in this tank. Uh, like that hair algae there was covering this rock. I can't believe that overnight they totally demolished the whole rock. <laughs> so I can't wait till my whole tank is cleaned up. That's for sure. Over here is just my red scarlet hermit. Chewing away at something. Brighten them up a bit. There we go. I like them. They're pretty neat. They just add a little more movement to the tank and uh, it's not like they really do much. They add a little bio load. They don't really clean up too much but kind of cool to look at, you know, my mobile algae shell. <laughs> He's still in the corner there, playing with himself. <laughs> I love these watermelon zoanthids in the uh, moonlight. They look great. Give me a sec and I'll show you for just a little quick glance. <clears throat> See if they turn out good. Oh yeah. Not too bad. The Favites is glowing. It's more green than that weird neon -y color, but the white balance is a little bit off. Um, it's the Acropora glowing away. The orange Yuma is trying to glow there. You know, this looks good. Okay, I put these lights back on. One sec. Ooh, sorry, guy. Scared the fish. Alright, let's get my wave going. And action. Definitely doesn't take too long <clears throat> to get it going. And it's about an inch once it's in the big swing. There we go. Just measure with my finger here. Let's we'll see. Well, that's the uh, most recent update, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, leave me some feedback, comment, 
uh, subscribe if you'd like and uh, just let me know what's up ciao